Hello YouTube, this is Tommy212 and uh, thank you for coming to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how to actually uh, um, jailbreak and unlock your iPhone uh, 4 with 5.0.1. So as you can see, I'll show you um, I'm running iPhone 4 on T-Mobile. It's an unlock jailbreak version and I'll show you real quick. This is one of the rarest one with the with 5.0.1 and as you can see the basement is 1.59.00 so I'll be showing you how to do that uh, hopefully you have the same baseband as this one because this is the only iPhone 4 baseband that's unlockable software unlockable anyway so here we go let's start let's just let's get started on it and first of all you would need to download um, Red Snow and, and an iPhone firmware and I'll put the link in the description for you guys to have an easy access on it um, this is uh, this will help you in restore in, in, in jailbreaking and unlocking your uh, your iPhone 4. There is another method which is punish tool. I like this one better. It's much easier, clear, and it has other options as well, such as uh, multi gesture, and we'll talk about that in a minute as well. Um, so first of all, um, we uh, if you are running an iOS 4 version, you need to jailbreak uh, cust create a custom firmware to actually be able to software unlock uh, uh, through jailbreaks CDO. And uh, the way to do it is you click on the extra and you, cre you create a custom IPSW from here. This is for you to preserve your base baseband. Click right here and from here you will browse to your folder where you will have your Red Snow and your uh, firmware that I will provide you in the link downloaded in your folder. You click on your firmware that you will download and click open. Once you click on it, it will create a no BB file. The no BB file, no BB means no baseband up update. So this will create this file right here and basically this will be the one that you need to use iTunes to restore and, 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 and install in your iPhone. Once you have this IPSW installed, you click on Palm DFU, you click on Palm DFU, next, follow the instruction on your screen which is basically bringing your phone into uh, DFU mode and I assume um, many of you guys know how to do it. So once you have this installed uh, in, in DFU mode, if you don't follow the instruction properly, don't. Pr if there's no problem, it will tell you that your phone is not in DFU mode, and you need to get it back on it. And um, just follow the follow it again, and you should be able to do it. Anyway, so once you have it on the DFU mode, it's like here, because I'm not doing it right now. I'm just telling you how to do it. It will tell you that you have not um, the no device detected. You probably missed the instructions, so just get on the Google or YouTube for instructions, and very simple, straightforward. Anyway, so once you have this in the DFU mode, you will just click on iTunes and click on Apple, uh, which is command option, and restore. Once you click on the restore, you browse it to your custom firmware, which is this one right here. No BB. Make sure, make sure, double make sure that you will click this one when you click on iTunes. If you click on this one, this is that will be it for you. Anyway, so this is the one you will do. You will need to uh, install. Well, once it's done, then you will just need to um, let it. Let, just go back to your once. Go back to your Red Snow. Once the uh, once the baseband update is done, uh, installation is done. You will click on jailbreak. It will tell you to put your phone back in the DFU mode. Put it in the DFU mode, and that's it. You'll see a bunch of command running on your phone. Just give it 10 to 15 minutes, and that's it. You're done. You will see Cedia installed on your on your jailbreak iPhone just click on Syria and this is now now you will be doing the the unlock which is from Micro Snow and that's where I really enjoyed it I, I'm so glad that I never upgraded my baseband and and I'm keeping it like this and hopefully in future versions I would not have to worry about it um, very very important this is the the only place the only part of this whole thing where I was very much very much uh, um, wanted to make sure that I'm, I won't really make any mistake as this part right here. I wanted to make sure I select this one and I canceled it and reselected it just to make sure that I'm not doing anything wrong. Anyways, um, there is just a little bit of lag on it. Okay, here we go. So, uh, basically you will need to do is go to manage. And I'm, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. <clears throat> go to source and from here you will put this repo in there which is ultra snow right here dave team repo right here you will go you will go to source you'll go to manage and then you'll click on edit and add it 
and you will just put this one ultra snow re ultra repo triple six dot com or whatever it is it's gonna come up in a minute on the screen come on There you go. Repost triple six dot com, and once you have, and this is this one right here. This one, you will go to click on edit. You click add, and you just add this one. Repost triple six dot com. When you have this added, go to search and type ultra snow and just install it. I had my SIM card in there. It was showing no no service. Once I installed the ultra snow. Boom! It was it, there was a few dart that came up, and right away I saw T-Mobile, and I was like, "Yes, that's what I'm talking about." So this is it. That's that was really nice. And then I have a bunch of other ones that I installed. One thing I'll tell you that right now Celia is jammed. There are like millions and millions of people who are trying to unlock and jailbreak their phones. So if you don't get this done, do not hesitate. That did happen. I mean, just wait for you know maybe a day or two, and then you'll be able to do it. I'm I'm really enjoying this new this new iPhone features and. Um, right here, this is this is the best one. Um, you know, I'm really really enjoying 5.0.1. Um, anyways, uh, I hope this in uh, this uh, tutorial was informative, and a lot of people will be able to jailbreak their phone and unlock their phone based on this. If you have any questions, any more concerns, if you would like to uh, write down in the comment, I will check it and reply back. I'm gonna be working on uh, next video to to let to tell you how to install. And activate FaceTime and iMessage. So, hopefully, um, that will work as well. Uh, thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate that. Thank you. And uh, if you like my channel, subscribe and uh, put a comment. Thank you.